Understanding the phrase, falsifying data. Hello everyone, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore a very important phrase in the English language, falsifying data. This phrase is not only essential in academic and professional settings, but also in understanding news and reports. Let's dive in and learn more about what it means and how it's used. Falsifying data refers to the act of deliberately changing or manipulating data or information with the intention of deceiving or misleading others. This can involve altering numbers, fabricating research results, or providing false information in documents. It's considered a serious ethical violation in many fields, especially in research, business, and journalism. Let's look at some examples to better understand this phrase. 1. In academia, a researcher changes the results of their experiments to make them align with their hypothesis. 2. In business, a company alters its financial records to appear more profitable than it actually is. 3. In everyday life, someone changes their age on a dating profile to appear younger. These examples show how falsifying data can occur in various contexts highlighting its relevance and importance. Falsifying data can lead to serious consequences, such as loss of trust. Once caught, the individual or organization can lose credibility and trust. Legal repercussions. In many cases, falsifying data can lead to legal actions, fines, or other penalties. Ethical implications. It raises questions about the integrity and moral values of the person or entity involved. Understanding these consequences helps in appreciating the gravity of this unethical practice. I hope this video has helped you understand what falsifying data means and why it's a critical concept in the English language. Remember, integrity and in handling information is key in any field. Thank you for watching and I look forward to bringing you more insightful videos in the future.